Hello, in this video I'll show you how I upload a YouTube video in 2018. So uh, the very first thing that I always do is I, I film my video, I do all of that, but then I go in and use this tool that you see up here called TubeBuddy. All right, and when I click on that, I'm gonna go down to the Tag Explorer here and select that. And what that does is that allows me to do some um, keyword and tag research. So I'm really gonna identify first what I want to call my file, what I wanna call my video. And this is one that I recorded with a friend named Craig Gordon. Um, so I'm just gonna type in Craig Gordon Music. That's the name of his channel. He came over and uh, wanted to record something and that's actually pretty good, very good actually. Uh, if you type in Craig Gordon Music, it comes up of a rank 75 out of 100, as you can see down here. The search volume is average. The competition is very low, so you're more likely to be found if you were to do that. So I'm going to go Craig Gordon Music, and then the song that we recorded is Share These Dreams. Let's see what happens when I input uh, that as my title. So my last one was 75, 76, so we have 64. So you can see here that the search is very low and the competition is very low. So I'm gonna go back and uh, it shows you down here what recent tags you use. So the last one was Craig Gordon Music, which was a good one. Um, I'm gonna go do some more research and say, okay, original song, share these dreams. And let's see how that ranks. All right, so that's 76, so that's good. And that's what I'm gonna call my document. So I'm gonna exit out of TubeBuddy, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the Upload button. Once I select Upload here, and I select a file to upload, I'm going to then go into my file that I had, and I've saved it under Share These Dreams. And you'll notice here, I already titled it Original Song, Share These Dreams, because I did my keyword research beforehand, and I'm going to select and choose that. So now while this is uploading, this is the time to go through this checklist and knock off all of the things that you should be. So the very first thing I'm going to call this is Original Song, Share These Dreams. So that's the name of the title, that's what I have put as my keyword, I personally like to capitalize. Capitalize my title just so it stands out. What's, what am I doing here? Share these dreams. And then what I'm going to do, that's the very first thing I'm going to do, you wanna make sure that the file you uploaded as well has the keyword in the title. So I called it original song, share these dreams. Next, you'll see I have some defaults already in my box, um, basically asking people to subscribe to my channel. So there's a call to action here where you can find the Greatness Everyday uh, links. So you can see our website, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and our podcast, which I need to upload very soon. Uh, do you know someone who's doing something great? Feel free to send us an email. So I'm asking people to reference and refer people to me that uh, real people living great lives, something we might want to feature on our channel. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm then going to go into the description. I'm going to title this again, Original Song, Share These Dreams. And from there, I'm going to just do a quick paragraph describing the song. So. My friend Craig Gordon is what he goes by uh, when he performs. My friend Craig Gordon stopped by and wanted to record an original song. Notice how I'm highlighting these things. Original song is in our title. It's in the first of our description and it's also in the paragraph that we're writing. My friend Craig Gordon stopped by and wanted to record an original song um, that he wrote over a year ago. And maybe we'll take that out. That he wrote and called Share These Dreams. So what I'm gonna do there now is say, um, give another call to action. Feel free to let us know what you thought of this. 
video in the comments below and we look forward to seeing you on another video so there we go we have our brief where you can find us and then I have my tags in here notice that my very first tag is the title of my channel the next tag is similar title um, I also have my name here um, but what I do is I write my tags in my description at the very bottom and then I add them in for tags here so the very first tag I'm going to do is again go back up and well I can type I can look at the artist Craig Gordon um, and then from here I'm going to type in the keyword the title that should always be one of your first tags um, original song share these dreams I'm also going to type in here share these dreams and capitals for your tags don't matter um, share these dreams I'm also gonna call this share these dreams Craig Gordon and the big thing when I'm making my tags you can do some research through TubeBuddy you can go down here in suggestions and they will come up with some suggestions for search you can purchase their premium version and they will also um, allow you to really access more you can see here only five of 28 results are shown I can select um, the plus sign to add in dreams as a tag um, you can purchase the premium version which will allow you to get more um, access to all of the tags share these dreams share the dreams okay and now what we're going to do is I like to think about if I was searching for this song or this video uh, with my other channel, the How To Scholar Education channel, it's a lot easier to think about what people are searching because they're math videos and science videos. Um, for an original song, that's different. But what would I type in if I was looking for this song? We've already put the title in. I would type in Craig Gordon Music. Craig Gordon Share These Dreams song. type in Craig Gordon original music Craig Gordon original song so many different things from here um, then I'll go back up here and I just realized that I did not um, link anything so I really should go down here before I say any of my social media accounts I would say go subscribe to Craig's channel here and I'll get the link for that so YouTube Craig Gordon music share these dreams let's see what comes up boom there he is we just uploaded this video yesterday here is the good-looking guy Craig Gordon um, so I've copied his channel I'm going to click and paste his link so that people can subscribe there that's a way for me to say thanks to Craig for coming in and uh, sharing that and then once you have all of your tags um, if you want to add more I'd encourage you to finish all of these up uh, as much as you can as long as they are related so I'm gonna fill these in original music and you'll see down here um, TubeBuddy highlights how much um, remaining spaces or characters you have left in your tags a lot of um, just if you don't have TubeBuddy um, it does not highlight and tell you what um, you're going to be left with so you just kind of like a guessing game it'll tell you eventually that you have too much um, so what we're going to do now is continue with these tags music original music uh, we're from Canada Canadian original music let's call it Another thing that I like to do is I like to add some tags, but then I like to put the year that we're in. I find that uh, one of my, actually my best ranking video was how to make a graph in Microsoft Excel, something that a lot of people have done. Um, but I think that because I put the year in it, which was last year, 2017, um, it did really well and had like something like 60 or just under 60,000 views as of now and um, that was it's not a very good video but it ranked very high because people saw the year and it got a lot of views which is great it drove traffic to my other videos on my other channel as well 
So here you see my description. I've put the tags in. Um, I'm going to go back through after this video and finish these tags. Um, another thing I like to do is always make sure that it's public, unlisted, or private, or scheduled. I'm going to set this right now as private. Um, the reason being is I'm going to send it to him beforehand and uh, just make sure that he's okay with it. That's always a good idea as well if you're uploading a video um, that somebody really is the focus of. Um, you want to make sure that they're cool with everything. Um, so I'm going to do that and I'm going to add this to a playlist. The only playlist I have right now is called updates. So I'm going to make one called music and that's what uh, Craig does so it makes sense. I have that uploaded into the music playlist. Now I'm going to go down here. Always want to make a custom thumbnail and I made mine previously. Um, so I'm going to go into the file that I had and I have the share these dreams thumbnail which I had made already. It should pop up here very shortly. There we go. Uh, you can go in and add some translations which are a really good way to get your videos found in other languages and parts of the world. Um, sometimes I'll go through after if a video is performing well and do that, um, but it just uses the automatic translation. In advanced settings, I already have this stuff filled out for the most part, um, but really I just focus on the basic information here. So um, there we go. You can go ahead and click done and that should be ready to go. Um, if it was public, you'd be able to see it right away. Hopefully your subscribers would be notified. Um, but like I said, I am going to take this link that you see here and send it off to him to get his approval before uploading it. So thanks for watching this video. I really appreciate you taking the time to uh, watch how we upload videos and kind of some of the really simple tricks um, that we have for uploading videos in 2018. Please be sure to subscribe to our channel um, and I hope that you have a good day. Thank you.